This demonstration will show you how to load data from an ODBC data source to create a new ClickView application. Click New in the File menu. Open the script editor by clicking the script button and make sure that ODBC is selected as a data source and select the connect button. I'll select an MX Access database and choose the database that holds the data I'm interested in. I click OK. The connect statement is automatically generated in the script. Now I want to select the tables. I click the select button in the list to the left, I see all of the tables, and to the right, all field names in the currently selected table. I'll select the customer table, and here, now choose all fields in this table. I click OK, and I can see a select statement has been generated. I now click the reload button. ClickView will automatically ask me to save the application before continuing. After saving it on my desktop, the script is executed and data is loaded into the application. The loaded data fields are now displayed in this sheet properties dialog. I click add all to add list boxes for each field. Selecting Canada in the country list box shows me that the ClickView associated logic is working straight away. Now I want to add additional data from another table. I simply open the script dialog and go back to my select. I confirm that I'm going to the same database, although perhaps I wish to go to a different one, and now choose from my order header table the fields that I'm interested in. Again, notice the addition of the uh, SQL SELECT statement, and also that in both my order header table and my customers table, I have a customer ID field. This is going to allow ClickView to establish a relationship between the order header table and the customer table, given the field name is spelled exactly the same in both tables. I select reload, and now I'm going to add the additional fields as list boxes to my screen. We now see that there's a link between our table based on the use of the word of the field customer ID and that that relationship is proving itself in the orders related to our country selection of Canada. Any change I make in these list boxes is reflected in the list of orders that I have here. A change or selection of order is associated immediately with the list of customers and countries that I have, proving again that ClickView's associative logic works as soon as I create the relationship between the tables.